is my terror right now. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? You girl just leaving the gym. You could see sweat on my neck and sweat on my brow. But it was a very good training session today. I didn't go yesterday. I don't even know if I told you that. I didn't go yesterday uh, because I had horrible sleep. Like, I could not sleep yesterday. So I only had like three hours of sleep. So when I woke up, took the kids to school, I was like, I ain't gonna make it in. But I have already been three days this week. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and I will be there again tomorrow. Uh, yeah, that's just that. Ethan wants some plaid pajama pants to wear tomorrow to school. Tomorrow's their last day before three weeks of winter break. So he wants either the red checkerboard or the black and white checkerboard. He said all his friends are wearing them, so he wants a pair, of course. Ashton doesn't even go to the same school as him, but she wants a pair too. So I'm like, okay, baby, I'll get you a pair too. We checked Target last night. Y'all were with me last night. We checked Target. They didn't have them. So I'm going to check Target and Ross again over in this area. And then I'll probably check another Target before I go home. If I can't find them, then I might check Walmart later. I ain't been inside of a Walmart in forever. That's just, I don't know. I'm just not a fan of Wally World. Wally, 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 Wally World. Wally, 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 Wally World. Y'all know New Orleans people, they, they turn bounce music into anything. From anything. Shoot. Sure. Okay, y'all. I was just checking in. I'll pick y'all back up when uh, when I'm actually doing something besides driving. What song is on right now? Nothing. We're at Five Below first. That would be great if they had them in here. Why black folks be saying five and below? Okay, let's see. See pajama pants. Oh, it's loud in here. Five below didn't have nothing. They had, um, I showed y'all them pants, but he wants the plaid ones. And I'm gonna get them damn plaid pants if I gotta make it myself, god damn it. <sighs> I know Ross ain't gonna have them, I just, like I just know. Y'all, it's so cold outside. 40 degrees today. 40. Yesterday was 80. This is crazy. Oh, here's today's outfit, y'all. The black long sleeve shirt top that I got from Dee Dee's. It has the thumb holes, black leggings, and then my new favorite shoes. They got two sweatsuits for $10. That's cheap. I'm about to get one. Oh, this is cute. It has like faces on it. What size is that? Extra large? This is cute. An aviator jacket? That's cute. If y'all drop something, make sure you pick it up and hang it back up. Be a good customer. Y'all don't sleep on Ross. A leather blazer for $12? Look at this. This is cute. Let me move this down. There's a blanket right here. Hold it. $12. Do I look like a Black Panther? Fight the power. Y'all, a faux fur bomber jacket for $9.99. That's the price. Not on sale, the price. Ross, okay. Ross might be a little bit better than Dee Dee's right now. Last few times I went to Didi's, I ain't find shit. Okay, so that was a fail, those last two stores. Finding his pants. Found myself some good shit, though. <laughs> that wasn't on the planner for today, but it is what it is. Found some cute stuff for good prices. Hopefully, I actually wear it. 
I'm headed to Target now. I'm thinking if Target doesn't have it, I'm thinking that I am gonna have to go somewhere I normally don't go, like Kohl's or JC Penney. Old Navy might have them. Yeah, I think I'm thinking I'm gonna check Target right now. Then I'm gonna check Kohl's because it's like a light, one light down. And if Kohl's don't have it, I'm gonna check. Yeah, Old Navy. Old Navy always has pajama bottoms. Y'all, why one of my friends DM me and said, I'm sick of you with this over ass hair. When I tell you I laughed from the bottom of my belly, I hollered out. Do I look like Oprah? Like I'm buying everybody a car for Christmas? <laughs> you get a car. You get a car and you get a car. I was feeling this hair. That is so funny. This Oprah ass hair. Nigga. <laughs> Oh, these are so pretty. I like this. These two are so cute. And those. When I move and get my aesthetically pleasing house, <laughs> I'm going to get stuff like this. All right, that was a fail. I'm actually not going to get an aesthetically pleasing house, but when I buy, I am going to most likely use an interior decorator. Um, there's a lot around Houston and I actually have two friends that have used this particular lady Well, she owns the company and when I tell you their houses are like stunning like magnificent so I'm willing to pay for the convenience because y'all know I don't have an eye for decorating y'all see my house I've had the same furniture forever like it's just not my thing so oh the sun Okay, your girl's getting a little hungry. Oh, okay, we're gonna go to Kohl's and then we might get us an egg white sandwich. Some coffee. I don't wanna have to pay for no damn coffee though. I hate paying for coffee when the coffee that I make at home tastes just as good, if not better. Come on, Granny. Fly, Granny. She fly, her hair blue and... Okay, girl. Y'all see her running by? Y'all ain't see her. She a little fly Granny. Baby, that's gonna be me, okay? That's gonna be me. Oh my God, y'all. I know I'm a day late. By the time y'all watch this, it's gonna be days late. Gunna got released yesterday. He got released by taking a plea deal. I don't know nothing about the courts and judicial system. I ain't never been, I ain't never had to go through none of that, okay? Thank God. I've never even had to spend a night in jail. But everybody was saying, he's a rat, he's a rat. And I'm like, how is him taking a plea deal a rat? I'm at the car wash, y'all. So I'm, ju I'm just doing a drive through My seats are disgusting. I really need to get them vacuumed, but I don't feel like stopping. I want to just get this drive through car wash, and I want to go to Old Navy. And I want to go home and eat. But anyway, I'm like, how is him taking that a plea deal? I did not watch the court thing where they showed him in court where they were like, Mr. Kitchens, you got affiliated with YSL in 2016 and da da da, da. Is this correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay, you know YSL to be an affiliated with da da da, da, da and that they are a criminal organization. Da, da, da. Is this correct, Mr. Kitchens? Yes, ma'am. You got stopped with Jeffrey Young Thug, whatever his real name is. You got stopped with Jeffrey and da da da, da. There were whatever these, those pills are, hydrocodone, methamphetamine, whatever. And there were uh, firearms and this and that and blah, blah, blah. Is this correct? And none of them were yours, correct? Yes, ma'am. That's snitching. Oh, that's snitching. That's snitching. Oh, my gosh. This is going to be so bad for Young Thug. I'm not saying like he should be saved or safe or whatever. You break the law, you pay the price. That's just what it is. That's that's what it is. You break the law, you pay the price. You get caught, you get caught. Like you you do the time. But I know in that street life, ah, oh, you just you don't you don't 
you don't rat. You don't rat. You don't say anything to fuck your people over who are actually going to trial, who are actually facing huge charges and huge jail time. They're saying that he played, that Gunna played such a small role that if he had to just shut up, kept his mouth closed, he would not have done any hard time. I don't think Gunna was a street dude. I heard Young Thug was a street dude way before he became an artist, a, a rap artist. I don't think Gunna was like that. I think Gunna was just a regular guy who knew how to rap. And once he got on in the rap game, he just got with, that's just who he decided to sign with and, and ride with. Like, this, he... Are you getting in front of me? Are you cutting me? Like, what's going on? Are you cutting me, sir? What? what? Y'all see, we're in line. What is this van doing? I mean, this truck. Are you cutting? Are, are you about to turn and... Oh, you are. Oh, you are. How rude. Get to the back of the line! Anyways, I'm not in no rush today, so I'm by. It's cool. Why? But why? Why are y'all cutting though? This is this is odd. Anyway, yeah. What's y'all's opinions? What do y'all think? Um. Yeah, like I said, it's hard for me to speak on it because I never, thank God, lived the street life. Thank God, none of my kids ever lived the street life. You know, and I'm hoping that they're never, never in a situation like this. But wow, what is Gunna's legacy going to be now? Everybody's saying he's a rat and a snitch. Are you going to be able to come back into the rap hip hop world and just like ain't nothing ever happened? Are they going to accept you back into the rap world? A lot of these rappers are, they got their hands in other shit besides just music. So, and now yo, you, a lot of them saying he's a rat. I Anyway, let me know what y'all think down below. And I think I've told y'all every vlog since Saturday. I'm putting nails on. I'm putting nails on. putting nails on. Nails ain't been on. Still ain't. I'm still naked nail. got me shining can y'all see that it look like i got armor all on my tires and i don't so positive vibrations positive energy positive thoughts we're gonna walk in old navy and i'm gonna find those pants i might even find them for myself too for ashton too and we can just take silly group pictures oh shit byron too yeah and we could take pictures in our pajama pants okay this is the store Okay, so I found the black and white pair. They're not really his size. Ethan's a 10 and these are an eight. Ethan is so skinny, he might be able to get away with them. Then I found this pulp set and it doesn't have a tag on it. So I'm about to scan them and see. Ashton can't wear an eight. They had two pairs of these black and white ones in a size eight. Ashton can't do them. Y'all know Ashton a little. She a little thick around the edges, so. But I'm gonna go ahead and probably buy them and then go to another Old Navy. Oh my God. Okay, I'm back home for a hot second. I just had to make sure my video completely uploaded and I did some, I just had to do some work pretty much. So I came home, I did that. These are the slurps that I bought from Ross. One is hazelnut, the other one is butter toffee. So I'm hoping that these taste good. I know hazelnut will, cause I mean, it's hazelnut. But butter toffee, I do not like toffee candy. I love toffee cookies, but like just toffee, I don't like at all. So I'm hoping it tastes like a toffee cookie. I don't know, but we gonna hope. It was only $4, so. Then I got this thing. It's a hook for the stockings. This was on sale for $3.99 and it was $7.99 at first. 
So instead of like actually putting hooks up here, see like these are the hooks that I had from last year and only one is still up here. And I'll probably take that. Let's see if it'll actually come down. You see the arrows? Oh, does it release it? Oh, it released it and didn't leave a mark. Okay. But anyway, this is what I have now. So I think this is a little bit nicer. And then you move the sleigh up until the 25 days of Christmas. So yeah. And then I believe I pretty much showed y'all everything that I bought. Let's see. So I did buy the leather jacket. And then I bought two blouses. Y'all know I love blouses. This is like a coffee brown color, which I love. Then this one is just like drawings of like, I guess, women's faces. Then of course, I could not leave this jacket for $9.99. Y'all, $9.99 for this jacket. And it fits so good. So I couldn't leave that there. Then these are the two uh, sweat outfits. These were $10 each. So I got one, I guess, medium brown color. And then this one is dark brown. They're both cropped with joggers, $9.99. So I did not try those on. So I'll try those on to see if I'm gonna keep them. And I also bought Ethan something for Christmas, which you guys will see later. Later, and I mean, when I mean later, I mean in like days <laughs> after Christmas. Or, you know, when they, when they open them, you'll, that's when you'll see them. Um, yeah, and that's it. Y'all, I have the same, if y'all remember like about two months ago, maybe even three months ago, I had like my, I was cut, my cornea of my eye was cut because one of my real lashes was pointing downward and it was irritated for like two days straight and I had to go see an eye doctor and I paid like $300. Then it was cut so bad I needed eye drops. And anyway, y'all, it's semi happening again. And I can see where my eyelash is going straight down. So I have my tweezers here. She cut it. The eye doctor cut it out my eye. I don't think I'm going to be able to get close enough to cut it. I feel like I'm going to have to find it and just pull it. <sighs> that that makes the hairs on the back of my neck stand up. Because if y'all know anything, pulling an eyelash can hurts. I don't girls who are like, oh yeah, I pick at my eyelashes. How? That shit hurts. And I got to get one single one and pluck that. Oh, Jesus be with me. Jesus be a fence. Jesus be a shield. Oh, oh you know what? I'm going to sit down and do it. Should I use this mirror? I think I'm going to use this mirror. I also have like a handheld mirror. Maybe I can use this one. And it has a light on it. Oh, did the light work? Oh, the light just went out. Damn it. Does this thing take batteries? Child. Oh well. I still can't believe that nigga say, I do not like you with that Oprah hair. I'm done. Okay. Whew. I see the, la I wonder if my, what I'm scared of, I see a baby lash just all by itself and it's pointing straight down. I said, that's gotta be it. But what if I pluck this fuck out and it ain't it. And I don't went through this pain for nothing. That is my terror right now. That is my freaking fear. <sighs> okay. Let's just do it. Find it first. <sighs> okay. Oh, and I'm about to yank hard and quick. Oh, Jesus. Okay. You got this, bitch. You got this. You can do it. I need a light. I need an extra light. Hold on. Okay. It's literally touching my eyeball. Okay, so let me put the light on the camera. I can't get it. I can't grab it. It's so little. Ow! Ugh! Bitch, I... Ah, touched my eye. 
That was it. That was it. Here it is. Y'all ain't gonna be able to see it. It's it's tiny, but it did not hurt when I pulled it. I'm I'm, just, I'm proud of myself. I did it. And my eye doesn't hurt anymore. Wow. A few months ago, I paid y'all. I paid almost three hundred dollars a few months ago, and I could have done it myself for the free free. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Ooh, we good now. Y'all, my eye has been irritated since yesterday. I was like, I know this cannot be happening. This has never happened with my girl, Mary, ever. All right, so like I told y'all earlier, the kids have half a day. Ethan has a half a day of school today and tomorrow. Ashton only has a half a day tomorrow, but I'm picking her up early when I go and pick Ethan up because she has a doctor's appointment at three o'clock, so. We're actually about to leave the house now. Go pick them up. Take her to her doctor's appointment. Then I got to drive back over to the school. She has a dance tonight. It's a lot. It's a lot, y'all. And I'm tired. I honestly might take her to the dance, sit in front of the dance, get my neck pillow, lean the seat back, and go to sleep. Because it makes no sense. I think I've told you guys before, I don't live by her school. Like, the school that she goes to, she's not zoned to it. It's just the school that they've been going to since kindergarten. So, that's why I keep them there. So, it's not close to my house. With no traffic, it's about a 15 minute drive. That's with no traffic. If all of the elements, the weather, everything is in my favor. Yeah, so for me to, it's from five to seven, for me to drop her off and then drive 15 minutes home, be at home for an hour, drive 15. I mean, I guess I could, I don't know. Y'all can't help me because it's about to happen, but I'm just venting, so y'all gotta hear the shit. So as I was leaving out, my Target package came. Let me open this real quick. I already told y'all what it is. That um, two-piece uh, active wear set from Target that I told you guys Aaliyah Face had. And I made a beeline to the store because I'm like, that is right up your girl's alley. I ordered one of the shirts because they didn't have the top on, uh, in store. Of course, to get free shipping... You know, you got to order some more. I had to get free shipping, so I ordered some hair mousse, some hair dye. Yeah, just some black hair dye and some mousse because I was all out of mousse. And I got free shipping. So this is the top. Chocolate brown top. I showed y'all the leggings in the other video. Such a cute outfit. I have it in cream and in this brown color. It also comes in green and like a baby blue. I was like, nah, I don't want those. The, the, these two neutral colors right up my alley. Okay, y'all, we're home. I'm about to cook dinner. I'm finally about to do the Trader Joe's items. This is the mandarin orange chicken. And then we also have chicken fried rice. Of course, I'm gonna doctor this up a little bit. I'm gonna add probably more egg to it. Let me see if I got shrimp. I don't think I do. No, I don't have shrimp, but it's fine. It already has chicken in it. So I'm just gonna add more, um, probably more ginger to it. A little bit more soy sauce and more egg. Dude, how do we cook this thing? Stove top. Stove top and microwave. Ain't doing microwave. That's for sure. And this one. Chicken. You can cook it in the oven or the skillet. So we're going to cook it on a skillet. Let's do it. y'all this is what it's looking like oh focus 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 ain't gonna focus i added two more eggs to it i also added sweet and sour sauce just a little bit and then uh soy sauce as well y'all know the soy sauce for fried rice soy sauce is what gives it its brown color 
okay it ain't gonna be brown if you don't use soy sauce so this is what it's looking like we're gonna do the chicken next well actually let's let's sample this let's do a little let's do a little ski taste don't burn your mouth gina mm. i'm gonna add a little ginger to it and a little garlic ginger is key in every asian dish okay Yo, this shit right here. Oh my God, I took a little tiny piece out to try it. It's so good. It don't even need the uh, mandarin sauce. I'm gonna put it on there because I wanna taste it, how the recipe goes, but oh my, it's so good so far, y'all. Maybe next week or this weekend, I don't know. I need another trip. I need another trip out there to uh, Trader Joe's because this right here, I need to re-up on this. I already know this is about to be hidden. Okay, y'all, that's what it's looking like. Ooh, it looks so good. The kids already ate and they loved it, loved it. Okay, moment of truth. It's good, y'all. Mmm, Mandarin chicken. Mm-hmm. stupid let me show you the cute jewelry that i got from forever 21 today i went to forever 21 y'all went to so many stores today i just put y'all down i'll let y'all take a little nap because i'm like i i y'all i think i went to like eight stores today yeah i wound up going back to two different old navies finding ashton pajama pants two pair of pajama pants a black checker pair a red checker pair she kept the red checker pair. Ethan now has two pairs of the black checker pair. Yeah, it was a lot. Anyway, so I went to Forever 21. Look at these hoops, y'all. And no, they're not just regular. Look how thick. Look how thick they are. But they're not huge. Like, they're, they're big hoops, but they're not huge, like, hanging all the way down to my shoulder. These were $5.99. Then I got these. Look how thick. Look how thick these are. But as you see, they're not like huge, but you can see them. These are so cute. These were $6.99. And then I found these rings. So it's a, what, a five pack of rings. Simple, cute rings. I really love that one in the middle. And these were $7.99. So, yeah, I'm about to try on my little sweatsuits from Ross in a minute. Girl, I know you lying. I know you lying to me, Ross. Y'all, look at this mess. Look at this mess. These are the sleeves of the hoodie that came with the set. This is how the sleeve is supposed to look. Why is this sleeve unfinished? Why is this sleeve unfinished? I just... Child, why? Let me see if the brown one is like this. I ain't never seen any regular. Not a brown one got regular sleeves. Let me see if the pants are regular. This was my favorite one too. I like this color. No, I need my little ten dollars back. I need my ten back. Actually, I'm gonna check a different Ross tomorrow and see. Cause I like for ten dollars. I like this a lot. I'm too through, baby. I just can't believe that. That that out of line. Oh my god! And why is my phone going crazy? Okay, y'all. I have been working. Do you hear me? I took me a shower. I recorded two, two sponsorships. I'm proud of myself. Pat on the back. Cause y'all know I was like dragging my feet with them. Now I'm getting caught back up. So I recorded two, I edited them. I have sent them off to the company. So when they wake up in the morning, they will see them. So whew, my goal is to do like two a day for like the next few days to get them knocked out. So we'll see. But I was just hopping back on to tell you guys good night. Cause I'm about to go to bed. I've just put a cream my night cream on my face i put my under eye cream cream on and i also put um a night mask on my lips so i'm about to go to bed i thought i was gonna take this wig off and put a new wig on tonight 
but that ain't happening i'm guessing i'm gonna do that tomorrow i really need to wash my hair i need to be braided up again uh, i just got a lot going on and it's not enough hours in the day but anyway no one likes to hear you complain so i'm not gonna do it i'm gonna go ahead and take my butt to bed so i will catch you guys tomorrow happy vlog miss day whatever it is hope you guys are enjoying and can y'all believe we're almost to christmas we almost to Christmas. By this point, by the time this video goes up, we probably gonna be like seven days away. Crazy, I know. <laughs>